Hello YouTube, Evan Jackal is back, and today, after a hard day of work yesterday, I'm going to unwind with Disney's Aladdin. With the help of the genie and the magic carpet, Aladdin escapes from the Cave of Wonders, and flies back towards Agrabah. Unfortunately, Abu cannot sit still, and as he scampers across the carpet, is blown overboard into the desert, which did not happen in the film. When Aladdin swoops down to rescue the playful monkey, he discovers that Abu has disappeared into the ruins of an ancient pyramid. Aladdin decides to enter the pyramid and find his friend. Remember when I said that this level set was completely against the movie? I didn't lie. Ah! Okay, I forgot about the sand eagles. Sand somethings, whatever the hell they are. It's a conveyor belt maze. I think these things can be killed with apples, but I'm not... Okay, I'm off my game. Hold on. I knew you could. Okay, and now you've got archers that fire two arrows, and I died because I'm a dumbass. Okay, that was embarrassing. Ah, there's a red diamond. I thought there was one around this first couple areas. Shit. Okay, I should stop running in this level. That's what's killing me. Oh, fuck. I should also remember how to hover, because I did say that's important, didn't I? Abu! Wait a minute! I've come to save your ass! Shit, I missed. Yes! I also didn't think I was going to get that one for a second. I don't remember this level being so annoying. I might have to... Yeah, I'm gonna have to cut off after this level set. Fuck. You got disintegrating platforms, too, so beware of those. Kill this fucking archer, because he's pissing me off. Here's a question for you. How did the Sultan's guards know to find Aladdin here? I mean, have they been tracking him or something? Because I'm pretty sure Jafar left him for dead. There we go. Another heart container. No! Can't grab the edges. <laughs> okay, so the edges that have sand going over them you can't grab. Good to remember that. Okay, don't even bother with those red diamonds, you already got them. You have to re get the scarab. Yes! At least I'm still lucky enough to get that. I'm not even going to bother with red diamonds in this one. I just want to get through this level. Continues. Ah, yes. The spike walls. Oh. Suddenly, Aladdin has become Indiana Jones.
Hello. Never seen that before. One up. Yes. Something I could use after all my fucking around the last level. There's apples. These are bouncy platforms that go in different patterns. See, I knew one of them had a red diamond in between them, and I fell. Okay, one thing about these containers, if you haven't noticed by now, um, when you overturn them, they always open in the opposite direction of which you were facing. Ow. Aladdin just got anally abused by a spike wall. I'm sorry, man. That's my bad. Oh, yeah, you swing on those. Bounce on the archer. Now, eventually, yeah, they just randomly change directions. Like I said, I'm not even going to bother getting most of the diamonds in this level because it's just annoying. Whoa! Oh yeah, and you've got guys who throw boomerang swords. And here's our next boss. Ah! Oh. See? Absolutely ridiculous. What were you thinking, you dipshit? You're so lucky I can't apple you in the face. And that's the end of the pyramid levels. Not exactly the most, uh... Not exactly the coolest level set there is. And I'm gonna save state here. So to YouTube, this is Eben Jackal saying, good night.